Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome, welcome, welcome to another Wednesday, which means it's time for another Nas Watches Steins Gate. It's a special Wednesday, Wednesday as well, because it's my birthday. Oh boy. I might be doing a stream today. Don't know. I might be doing like a, like a big stream, like in the middle of the day instead of it at night. So hey, feel free to tune in for that, twitch.tv slash Nozichan. Or maybe wish me happy birthday in the comments at the very least, because I'm happy. Probably won't suck. Probably will be better than every other day in my life. Anyway, so in the last episode... God, that was fucking dark. Uh, in the last episode, um... In the last episode, Steins Gate happened, nothing was fucking explained, and... Uh, you guys gave me some really nice uh, feedback on the new system I was working on. So now the system, I think, is perfected, and uh, nobody should have any more problems syncing up anything ever. So, there you go. Uh, and I, I honestly, I don't understand what the fuck was going on. Like, honestly, and I, I don't want to really say... I don't even want to blow smoke out my asshole, because I don't... I don't know what's gonna fucking happen, so I'm gonna shut my fucking mouth, and we're going to start, and we're going to start, and then we're gonna come to our conclusions at the end, okay? Okay, three, two, one, and go. So yeah, he comes out of the elevator, and she's there, even though she's dead. And I'm like, and I was really confused, I'm like, so he went back in time, but his text message went further back in time, and everyone was really confused. And also, this guy's really bad at money management, apparently. Hello, waifu. Hello, new waifu. Let me creep the fuck out of you really quick. That's not how you do a head pat, fam. No, don't, don't grab the titty, you fucking moron. This is how you, this is how you wind up in a sanatorium. Oh boy, especially with how the Japanese, especially with how the Japanese fucking, yep, the Nakabichi thing was cancelled, oh boy, so th that, I feel like that Gachapon's gonna come back and bite us on the ass. Is she gonna recognize it? Time travel? And there's the opening. So apparently, the version I watched last week didn't have an opening. I didn't know that, so... Oh boy, I'm gonna leave this in because I want to talk about it a little bit, and I want to look at it. Um, music's really good, but it's distracting. Um, so... I'm not quite... This is probably, like, the most confused I have been going into an anime, in that... Even the fucking opening doesn't make any goddamn sense. It's fucking clones everywhere. It's like, like time travel duplicates kind of thing. And... And it, but like the thing is, it works in that I feel like I'm not supposed to know anything going in. It's like, oh, like he's at this fucking uh, f uh, conference, and then me woman gets stabbed. He sends a text message like, "Hey, yo, this bitch got stabbed," and then like he passes out or something, and he wakes up, and it's like a week before. It's like th like the day's restarted, and his text message went like three weeks back in time, and it's really interesting and weird. And, like, they, they just straight up, like, give you the time travel off the bat. They're like, hey, yo, look, he's going to a fucking time travel conference. Like, time travel is on the table to fucking start with. And it's like, and, you're, and you, just, you just have this thing of, how is this working? It, like, are we going, like, back to the future style? We got, like, parallel universes. We've got fucking time travel duplicates. Do we have alternate, do we have fucking... Like, a, a singular timeline? Do we have, like, six timelines? Like, it doesn't, like, mmm. Mmm, it, it gets very concerning a little bit. That, that magazine is called Sciency. But, but, that's the best name for a magazine I've ever fucking seen. No, you moron, you time-traveled. It should be, the, it should be fairly easy. Wait, is she Dr. Nakabichi? She's Dr. Nakabichi. Really? Heretic! It says you're a heretic. Time Vault Infidel. Oh, yep. 
Fuck, he's triggered. He's triggered. Hacker man's just like, man, shut the fuck up. That's why you should, why you should never take your helmet off. Theoretically impossible. You fucking stupid. You fucking stupid. Time's not even a real thing. Like, time... Okay. Wait. I should... I should specify. Time does not work the way we think it works. It work. It... The, the way... The reason why we think it works the way it works is because if we perceived it in the way that it actually works, our fucking minds would explode. There. That's... Oh, no. She's a different person. Nakabichi was a different doctor. All right. Except no, though. Like, this, this, this is wrong. This is wrong. This is, like, completely discounting... This is using string theory, the theory that makes time travel a possible... ...to disprove time travel. Are you fucking stupid? Are you fucking stupid? Makasi, whatever your name is. Like, string theory is the theory, or at least a part of it, is, is the one that tells us that time does not move in a straight line, we only perceive it in a straight line because we're fucking morons. Like, like, who was it that said that, who was it that said time only moves in a linear fashion? Oh, wait, sorry. Who, oh god, so someone said, someone said, time only exists so, so things don't happen to humans all at once, or something like that. Or, was it Einstein, or was it Stephen Hawking? Some dead guy said it. I am still paying attention, but nothing really all that interesting is happening yet. So, don't, don't take my rambling to mean that I'm not paying attention. Jesus fucking Christ. They're just doing stupid slice of life shit I don't care about right now. Yep, yeah, raise that morale. Man. If you didn't have that whole flat justice thing going on, the morale would probably get higher. <laughs> oh, man. Magic. Please tell me that's bullshit. Please tell me he's fucking with her right now. Okay, yeah, it's fake. It's a fake store for like that he got for fucking nine bucks. All right. Watch this turn out to be a real thing that she can do. The spirit is forcing me to masturbate. No. TIME TO FAT! <laughs> Jesus. Wait, no, wait, no! OH YES! WE GOT IT, BOYS! THE TRAP HAS LANDED! THE TRAP HAS LANDED. We are, we are in, boys. We're in. It is hot indeed. We're back, we're back in, boys. We've hit the golden age of anime. Where traps replaced real women. Oh, kind of makes me wish I, I hadn't, I haven't, wa I hadn't watched Himagoto yet. That'd be a fun react. It'd be the shortest reacts ever, because they're only like five minutes long. By the way, Himagoto, if you if if you want like a funny a fun anime based on traps that everyone thought was awful, there you go, Himagoto. Go watch that shit. It's the it's the best anime that everyone hated. Don't get hit by a car, you're standing in the middle of a sidewalk.
I think I would have heard someone getting brutally stabbed to death now, Kareen. Come on now. Man, those Code Lyoko kids really stopped Xana this time. <laughs> Why do you pronounce it that way? Oh my god, that's adorable. His thing says I heart C- You know what? That's a fucking Smash Bros player right there. He, he loves CRT TVs. Wow. I love Super Smash Bros. And I need more CRTs for a meetup. You're hired immediately. <laughs> what? What? Is everyone in this show mentally deficient? <laughs> Oh, Kareen, does your brain not work no good? Seems to be. Oh boy, here's our protagonist, ladies and gents. Right after I shut up those damn lizards running Facebook. I'll get you, Zuckerberg! <laughs> the coin opens up, it's got a mouth. <laughs> God, this is some stupid fucking shit going on now, man. But thing is, I don't hate it, though. This is stupid fucking shit done right. So the satellite caused the time travel? Mute. Oh, God, it's called Mewtube and Goodle. God damn it, Japan. Why can't you be really semi-creative? Why can't you, I don't know, make up a search engine called Bing? Because that doesn't exist. Wouldn't put it past you, fam. Really wouldn't. Your brain kind of not work no good. Ah, uh, yes! Japanese 4chan! A time traveler shirt, lol, 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 fuck. Post, sh post picture of you in future with shoe on head, faggot. <laughs> Tits are GTFO. They're just saging the thread. <laughs> oh my god, they're fucking! I was gonna make the joke that they're not do they're not making 4chan nearly dismissive enough, but no, they're doing it. They're saging his thread and calling him a faggot. Then and, and basically doing memes. Oh, so we got parallel worlds going on. Ooh. That's my that's my favorite. Yes, a guy named Jonathan Titor is Japanese. The most Japanese name I've ever heard. Oh yeah, this guy was mentioned in the first. And there's a fucking page on cat girls, because of course there is. Stop playing fucking Neko Para while you're looking up time travel, dude, for real. Masaka. Fifty-six, you idiot.
Wow. Looks like your friends have come in and told you, no, stop this stupid time travel shit, fam. Get rid of it. He drifted again. He drifted. He drifted into a timeline where Titer never went back. Or at the very least didn't blow up. I'm very confused. But I think he might have drifted into a timeline where Titer didn't blow up. Hey, no more- no candid pictures, or the weirdo in the fucking Rick and Morty cosplay. I meant to take a picture of your pantsu, as is Japanese tradition. What? Explain yourself. <laughs> is she a is she a time traveler? Does she travel through time? And now blackmail happens. And now blackmail happens. Take me to your primitive hacker man, or I will destroy you with my, with my soul capturing device. What is an email? Is it the same thing as? Oh, did she already have it? What? Is it the same thing as the telepathic messages we use in the future? Why? Why? Every th every sentence is ended with the word nya. This is this is this is this is cringe. This is that this is that this is that good shit. This is that good cringe just Fucking rubber band around my bicep and just eject that directly into my veins. Oh my god, that fucking black tar cringe. Fucking, you have to melt it on a spoon before you can take it. Christ. I'm trying to find a way to flatten her into 2D. One day I'll figure out reverse 3D printing. Legendary retro PC. My fucking computer teacher in high school had one of those. He had a fucking stack of those. Like... Christ, they're not that hard to get unless Japan just fucking melts down everything.
Hey. Here's a message from the past. What? Yeah, no, that's sending that to her present day phone. Oh no. Oh no. I, I have very few words as to what the fuck is happening right now. So yes, yeah, so you microwave tore apart that banana in on the molecular level, okay. But why though? Why do you have a fucking Atom Smasher microwave? Okay, Rick, calm the fuck down, wubba lubba dub dub, Jesus Christ. No, she gonna kill you. She gonna kill you. Fucking, she just, she just fucking slides in, she's like, you best not touch my bananas, motherfucker. I'ma end you. What, are you one of the, like, so is this he trying to do some libertarian, or is he trying to do something communist? Taxation is theft re, or... Wow, he actually did something he intended to do. Order, execute order 666. Destroy the Jedi Temple. But where is the banana? This is the first time, this is the first time in, well, like, almost 40 minutes he's actually done something. He sent the banana back in time. He sent it back in time. He made a time travel microwave. No, it's a time machine, you moron! But it works on time cop rules! Bitch, you said time travel weren't possible, but he just fucking did fucking tracer on that. Alright, and then that's the end, right? Yeah. That's the end, Jesus Christ, so... Oh boy, alright, so I feel like, so I feel like this, oh god, we have, I have, I feel like I have less fucking information than when I started, oh man. So I feel like this anime is kind of going mm, in reverse order in that we're getting answers first, and then we're getting the questions later, and, oh boy, oh fuck me, I, my head kind of hurts, my head kind of hurts, oh fuck, but. That's, so so he finally made an invention that actually fucking works. So hey, thumbs up on that. Um, a lot of this a lot of this was just kind of slice of life bullshit that I didn't care all too much about because I Ocarine is annoying. Uh, Hackerman is Hackerman doesn't deserve all the shit that he has to fucking deal with on a daily basis. Um, the trap was nice though. So that's grade A. That is grade A trap right there. As the straightest trap you've ever done seen. Like straight, straight as a fucking. I don't know. Straight as a thing that I don't actually have here. I've got very few actual straight things here. I've, like everything's kind of got a little bit of a curve to it. Hmm. <laughs>
I don't know. Um, fucking, uh, oh, man, that, um, the whole, like, once again, like, we're, we're, once again, we're on, like, this, this, like, extended mystery thing, which was just, like, things aren't making a whole butt-ton of sense, and it's just really, really, really confusing. Um, I guess really all I can say is, like, where I think things are going to go, and then see where it goes up, right? But it's, like, from a story-wise perspective, I'm very confused, but I like being confused in this situation. Like, there's a lot of cringe, but it's like that black tar cringe that makes you, instead of making you go, ooh, ooh, no, go to, ooh, ooh, ugh, it's like, it's more like, ooh, ooh, that's gross, but it's like a car crash. I know it's gross. I know, like, that guy's arm should not be in that direction, but I kind of want to keep looking, see what, see what else they pull out the fucking wreckage there. Like, oh, ooh, that's a baby carriage. Oh, no. Like, like you know, like, like just like, you're driving down a fucking highway and there's like a car crash. And you just, you just, every, everyone slows down to see what they're gonna, what fucking body parts they're gonna pull out. Um, like the bystander effect, or whatever the fuck it's called. I uh, it just, like, we got some new characters, really interesting. Um, the big twist at the end, we're finally getting to, like, a big twist at the end where we have, like, the first inkling of a, of a time machine slash teleporter thing. But it's not super great because it took that gel banana from the first episode and now it's extrapolated on it. So now instead of breaking it down a molecular level, it's not only breaking it down a molecular level, it's also sending it to a previous quantum state in that it was attached to the bunch. Kind of like how Tracer's time travel works in Overwatch. And that's, re and that's also a really interesting kind of thing. And it's uh, something that I hope they explain rather decently. They don't have to explain it well. They just had to explain it decently. So the bar doesn't have to be all that high on that one. I don't know. Um, but still really still really interested. Still having fun. Uh, just, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Fucking, it's like a kid on Christmas right now. Uh, and anyway, everybody, so let me know what you thought of this down there in the comments. I don't really have much else to say, uh, except maybe... I, I, I'm wondering whether this microwave is going to expand into a t into an actual honest-to-god time machine, and maybe they'll explain how things happened initially. Maybe they go back in time and do do it that way. Maybe Ocarine is is maybe Ocarine is John Titor. Maybe that girl from before is John Titor because she's obviously not exactly within actual time and space. Because oh boy, that's fucking fishy as hell. Um. Yeah, let me know what you think of all that down there in the comments, because I, I, I got nothing. I, I fucking got nothing. It's enjoyable. It's enjoyable. I liked it. It's fun. And it's funny in places. Just fucking thumbs up on that. Uh, Ocarine is still annoying, though. Still kind of annoying. Like, he, he strikes me as the kind of person who watches Rick and Morty and quotes it verbatim. Like, he's the kind of guy who would jump up on a McDonald's counter and shout, I'M PICKLE -ree! Like, he's that kind of guy. Uh, he probably thinks he has a 200 IQ, too, because he watches his... Yeah, nah. Anyway, everybody, so, yeah, as always, I am Nozzer. If you want to help me keep the lights on, I improve the equipment and stuff going on, and not kick the not kick the light, I should probably stop doing that. Um, and also, you know, food is nice. I like, the, I like that. That's really nice to have. Then, hey, feel free to support me on Patreon, or, uh, or support me on TAD. Link down there in the description. And, hey... Oh, speaking of Patreon, that's also where you get to recommend, uh, I think, games and shows and aminés and stuff to be Let's Played, reviewed, reacted, and all that, and streamed, and all that good shit. So hey, that's another thing. This was, I mean, this was one. This was recommended by, by Nanako. And hey, Nanako, I hope you're enjoying this, because I am. Anyway, everybody. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, share on social media if you wish, and I will see you in the next video. But most importantly of all, become a trash mammal today, and I will see you a round day.